Central Park is this literally an oasis. It's like a magnet. Jeffrey Kimball with the New York City Audubon Society has spent hundreds of hours watching birds in Central Park, celebrating the many different species that pass through here. But things are changing. What have you noticed over the course of the years well, in terms of bird population? Well, I have, you know, anecdotally, in my 20 years in the park, I have seen a tremendous decline. The massive losses extend across the United States and Canada, according to a new study in the journal Science. In all, researchers have seen a 29% decline over the past 50 years. Nearly 3 billion birds have disappeared. That was staggering. That really sort of caught us you know, in our tracks. It was a, a, a punch to our, to our guts. Pete Mara with Georgetown University is a scientist and a lifelong bird enthusiast. He says it's not just rare species of birds that are declining, but also the common ones across a dozen different bird families, especially grassland and shorebirds like the red knot, whose population has dropped by 90%. This is being caused entirely by humans. The habitat loss, which is the primary driver here, other issues like free roaming cats, buildings, collisions with buildings, pesticides. Mara believes cats alone kill as many as 1.4 billion birds each year. Both he and Kimball say the decline is a signal our ecosystem is in crisis. Birds are, uh, you know, they're a bellwether for the whole ecosystem. With that ecosystem in danger, so is a treasured piece of this nation's natural history. Kenneth Craig, CBS News, New York.